Good morning, prayer warriors. Okay, I am um, challenge here today. Start recording. Welcome, everyone. Happy and blessed Monday, prayer warriors. So sorry because I have to work so many days, and sometimes I have to leave, you know, the hospital like early morning instead of leaving at uh, eleven o'clock where I'm supposed to. Be hello, Tita Eve. Good morning. And Tita Nanette, thank you for joining from Manila. So I hope that, you know, you guys will also overcome the temptation of, you know, Satan not to pray because, you know, I feel that every time I need to do this, there's always something that would come out that would prevent me from praying with you guys like this morning I was already set up and then all of a sudden I I figure out that I am not what actually streaming on the YouTube so hi Annabelle and of course Cherry Ann hello Marites how are you thank you for joining from Manila so we will continue okay persevere to finish strong you know how we say that in Igbaras, hindi magpaloy-paloy. Like we need to continue even though it's hard for us to pray. We still need to persevere. Hello, Tita Mimi. Thank you for joining from uh, Arizona. So we will continue the catechism, okay? So the sanctural in the liturgical year. So we are now in catechism 1172. Hello, Nining. Mary Ann, thank you for... Um, putting the link there to our uh, YouTube channel. And Agnes, thank you for joining from uh, Singapore. And of course, Mercy and Chloe. Hello, Chloe. Um, so the in celebrating this annual cycle of the Mysteries of Christ, Holy Church honors the Blessed Mother, right? The Mother of God with a special love. In fact, you know, last Saturday it was uh, we celebrated, you know, Our Lady of Mount Carmel. So there are so many uh, times in the liturgical year that we give honor to our Blessed Mother. So I don't know if you remember that our liturgical year always start with the Easter Tridium. Okay, so that's when the start of you know our. Um, liturgical year if you notice that um the vestments of the priest the and also the church is different it is depending on where we are in the liturgical year so but you know during those different uh times in our liturgical year we always celebrate mary the mother of god with she is inseparably linked with the saving work of her son. In her, the church admires and exalts the most excellent fruit of redemption and joyfully contemplates as in faultless image, in that which she herself desires and hopes wholly to be. And that was Saint Athanasius, uh, from Saint Athanasius, okay? So, Catechism 1073 said, When the church keeps the memorials of martyrs and other saints, during the annual cycle, she proclaims <clears throat> the paschal mystery in those who have suffered and have been glorified with Christ. She proposes them to be faithful examples who draw all men to the Father through Christ. And through their marriage, she begs for God's favor. So, you know, all the saints in heaven, right? They were victorious during their life on earth, and now they are joining with Christ. So that's why we ask for the intercession of the saints, because we know that they are near, with, near Christ all the time. So, you know, if you have a friend, right, and you want something from somebody, that your friend is friends with, of course, you're going to ask a favor from your friend to talk to that person. The same thing, same thing as the saints in heaven. 
you know, we ask the intercession of Mama Mary, of course, because Jesus always listens to his mother, you know. St. Faustina, St. Monica, you know, for those who have problems with their spouse and their children, St. Monica is, you know, those saints with, who are patron, our patron saints. You, If you have dryness and problem with speaking the truth and talking about the gospel, you know, talking about your burning love of God, yet you're afraid to talk about it because you don't want to be persecuted or you want you don't want to lose people who doesn't believe in God, then we have to pray to St. John the Baptist, right? Because St. John the Baptist was beheaded because speak for speaking the truth. Hi, Arwen, Arwina, and of course your baby. And, you know, thank you for being a loving and, uh, you know, you're, so I, I'm putting Arwina here on the um, spot because she has a uh, developmentally delayed son, right? That is total care. But, you know, the way she takes care of the son, you will see that, you know, the love of God there. And I think sometimes, you know, we we were thinking, okay, how could this mother, you know, do this day by day, you know, that all she does is take care of the son who is total care. But I think that makes her a saint, right? She's developing into sainthood and around all of us who are actually looking at what she's doing. It inspired us that, you know, our sacrifice sometimes they are inconvenience, but yet there's other people who embrace the cross that God give them, right? So there you go. You know, Arwina, when she I see her taking care of her son, it inspired me that you know what? I could love others, you know, even how unlovable they are. I will try my best, you know, to love them because you see a mother, right? who's dedicated, compassionate, and persevering to take care of the son, you know, that could not live without her help. So I think sometimes we have to look at, you know, the crosses that God give us, you know, the way that it's building us into holiness, you know, becoming a saint. Hello, Manang. Hello, Carol. Thank you for joining in Tucson, and of course, Manang Dimple joining us from uh, New Jersey. Hi, Nan. Jennifer, thank you for joining us from Igbaras. So, now you will know why we celebrate, you know, the Feast of the Saints or the Martyrs of the Church. So the liturgy of the hour. So you hear liturgy of the hour. So what are those? Okay, these are the hour where we spend specific time of the day, you know, to be closer to God. That like we reconnect to God, you know, during, you know, from the time we wake up, we do our, of course, we do our work, you know, we have a job to do, you know, we take care of our family, but some like the priests and the religious they what they have what they call the liturgy of the hour which which they reconnect with god you know when we like for example we are using our cell phone right towards the end of certain time the battery the juice goes away the same thing i think as our burning love to god if we just don't reconnect with god our juice also goes away right they they run out of, you know, that burning love if we don't reconnect with God. So the liturgy of the hour for all the priests and the lady, that's what they uh, willfully do, okay, to reconnect to God, to recharge. Okay, hello, Mommy Cecilia, good morning, and thank you for joining from Arizona. So the mystery of Christ, His incarnation and Passover, which we celebrate, in the Eucharist, especially at the Sunday assembly, permeates the trans and transfigures the time of each day through the celebration of the liturgy of the hours, the divine office. This celebration 
faithful to the apostolic exhortations to pray constantly is to devise that the whole course of the day and night is made holy and praise to God. In this public prayer of the church, the faithful, you know, clergy, religious, and lay people exercise royal priesthood of the baptized, celebrated in the form approved by the church. The liturgy of the hours is truly the voice of the bride herself addressed to the groom. It is the very prayer which Christ himself, together with his body, addresses to the Father. Hello, Rosan. Welcome. Welcome to the Prayer Warriors. Thank you for joining us from Igbaras. So, in Catechism 1175, the liturgy of the hours is intended to become the prayer of the whole people of God. In, in Christ it's himself continues to priestly work through the church. His members participated according to their own place in the church and the circumstances of their lives. Priests devoted to the pastoral ministry because they are called to remain diligent in prayer and the service of the word religious by the charism of their consecrated lives. All the faithful, as much as possible, you know, the pastors of the souls, in common in church on Sundays and on the more solemn feast, the laity too are encouraged to recite the divine office, either with a priest or among themselves, or even individually. So the celebration of the liturgy of the hours demands not only harmonizing okay the voice with a praying heart but also a deeper understanding of the liturgy and of the bible especially of the psalms as i was talking before you know the psalms is uh, the part of the bible that not many people use okay but the psalms are the prayers okay these are the prayers of our fathers you know long time ago and they put it you know, in a book called the Bible. So these prayers had been used, you know, long time ago, like in the Old Testament even. And yet, you know, if you read the Psalms, everything that happens in our lives that we would not, that we like to reconnect with God is there. Okay, so if you have time, try to browse on the Psalms. Hello, Ami. Thank you for joining from Iloilo. So, uh, Catechism 1177, okay, the hymns and litanies of the liturgy of the hours integrate the prayer of the Psalms into the age of the church, expressing symbolism of the time of the day, into the age, the liturgical season, or the feast being celebrated. Moreover, the reading of the word of God at each hour, with the subsequent responses or Troparia and readings from the fathers and spiritual ambassadors are certain hours reveal more deeply the meaning of the mystery of being celebrated, okay, assist in understanding the Psalms and prepare for silent prayer. The lectio, the lectio divina, where the word of God is so re read and meditated that it becomes prayer is thus rooted in the liturgical celebration. Any of you guys heard about the Lectio Divina? Okay, so when I was uh, studying the scripture, you know, that's the only time I was able to hear about that. That You know, when you read passages in the scripture, you keep repeating it, you repeat it, and then you meditate on it. And then you're gonna, uh, after meditating, you're going to make a prayer to the Lord based on that meditation, okay? And then, and then after that, you make a promise, right? Or what you you have to make an action or a, a plan of what you need to do based on the word of God that you just meditated. You know, by doing that, actually, it makes you a better Christian, a better, you know, mother a better sister or a brother because every day you become a better person by meditating and making a decision of what you do on that day based on the word that you just meditated you know 
truly I am um, guilty on this because I could not do that daily also. I, uh, you know, we have to do our <laughs> uh, job, okay? Sometimes our job, you know, requires us to work 12, 14 hours, you know, to serve others. And sometimes, you know, we are already exhausted when we reach home. We could not do that thing. But what I do is I just, in during the day, remember I was saying about the Jesus prayer that, you know, even how busy you are, you could just stop, you know, for like, three five minutes and do the jesus prayer it's not even take five minutes but if you really want to reconnect with god you know during throughout the day on certain times so the day especially when you are stressed on your job on what you are doing you could just take a deep breath and say lord jesus christ son of the living god have mercy on me a poor sinner because that is just a complete prayer us you know us Asking God, you know, we adore God. We know that God is there and we adore God and we know how uh, sinful we are. And thus we are just asking God to have mercy on us. So Jesus prayer, Lord, you know, Lord Jesus Christ, son of the living God, have mercy on me or have mercy on us like the poor sinners. Very easy, easy to remember and easy to pray so we're gonna stop here actually gonna this is the last paragraph the liturgy of the hours is which is like an extension of the eucharistic celebration does not include but rather in complementary way calls forth the various devotions of the people of god especially adoration and worship of the blessed sacrament so when was the last time you visit the Blessed Sacrament? Because now the church is open. So when was the last time you spent time with the Lord in the Blessed Sacrament? So that I think that uh, that is our challenge today, okay? At least we we go once a week, right, to spend time in the Blessed Sacrament. It just... There are so many things that would make us stay away from our faith, okay? Because that's what Satan do, right? Satan always tempt us of the world, flesh, power, money to stay away from God. So if we don't make a decision right now that we will willfully connect ourselves throughout the day, you know, with our Lord, then it becomes become harder for us you know to to be closer to god and once we drift away it's very easy difficult to come back yeah i know that because it happens to me every time i drift away it takes me so many days so many weeks to really come back so the thing with us prayer warrior is if we make a promise that we're going to pray together, you know, every time that, you know, I'm not working or then, you know, that commitment, that commitment, you know, God is already very pleased with that. Okay. When we make that commitment, you know, things that we sometimes we don't really want to do, but still we do it. It's not about the feeling, right? That we want to pray. But it's the will, the will that we have to do that because we promise God to do it, right? We keep our promise because God always keep his promise. So today we will call actually the saints because um, we need our friends. We need our friends in heaven to bail us, <laughs> to help us with our needs. So we're going to call them and ask for their intercession. So. Let's quiet ourselves. Okay. Let's mark ourselves with the cross as we belong to the family of God in the name of the Father and of the Son of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Let's take a deep breath through your nose. Okay. And do it slowly. 
Breathe in. And hold it for four seconds. And let go. One more time. Let's breathe. Breathe in through your nose. Let your lungs fully expand. Like every crevices of your lungs be expanded. Now let go. Let go everything that is not of God. Okay? Everything that is causing us to have anxiety. Causing us not to have peace in our hearts. You know, unforgiveness. Envy. Regrets, our preoccupation with our past. Take a deep breath. And let go everything now. We're going to offer that as an intercession for the intercession of our Blessed Mother. Breathe in us, O Holy Spirit, that our thoughts may always be holy. Act in us, O Holy Spirit, that our work too may always be holy. Draw my heart, or our heart, O Holy Spirit, that we love what is holy. Strengthen us, O Holy Spirit, to defend what is holy. Guard us, O Holy Spirit, that we will always may be holy. Amen. St. John the Baptist, please intercede for us as we are losing our burning desire or our fear to spread the word of God and speak for the truth. Saint Monica, help us to be dedicated to our family and to guide our children, you know, our spouse, to follow the difficult path towards heaven. St. Francis, intercede for us that there will always be peace in our heart and that we become channel of peace to others. St. Demphna, intercede for those who have problems with depression, anxiety, panic attacks, and hopelessness. St. Philippina, intercede for those who have problems with lust. St. Michael, the Archangel, please protect our family, especially the weakest members of our family, our children. Now, we're going to offer this rosary for the following intentions. For all our leaders, so they will protect life from conception to death. And that... If they have stolen money from the coffers of the government, that you will touch their hearts so they will return it in some other ways. Because there's so many people who are starving and needing help. For safety of Cardinal Joseph Sen, who's still in prison in Hong Kong. For good health of those celebrating their birthdays this month, especially James Flores, Gurley Igiko, James Doff. Dophilis, Nining Harapa, Mildred Inshaw, Merle Wen, Tita Carmen, Mimi, Tita Mimi Markings, Tita, Tito Mike Furman, and Tony Guevara. For 
safety of all frontliners, especially my co-workers, secretaries, the paramedics, housekeepers, the food services, transporters, the scribes, especially the priests who are giving the last rites for safety of all OFW, especially Kim DeFondo, J. Perez, Mary Grace Yosoya, Mila Dison, and Gail Iscomas. And for all our graduates, especially our children, that they will pursue the career that they love and that they will always do everything that is pleasing to God, even how difficult it is. For those who are looking for jobs, may they find dignified work. And for special intentions of Father Miguel, Father Dixon Davis, and their mission to Madagascar, Bishop Kikanas, Father Butch, Father Roming Subaldo, Father Ronnie Gonzalez, Father Juji, Father Butch Espeleta, Father Timiliesa, Father Danny Montania. Nang baby, Medacielo, Carolyn Iscanlar, Al Father Albert Miranda, Julieta Barber, Flora Bartosilio, Jeanette and Biboy Prania, Bless Noblesa, Glad Pili, Bel Palma, Carrie and Chris, Val Boatner, Rosalina Gansha, Marilu Ilamparo, Mommy Letty and Artie, the Tanalion family, for healing of body and spirit of the following, especially Jacob and, you know, comfort to his family. Carolyn, Carl Joseph Perez, Ricardo Sidanio, Joey Iluso, Father Benji, Clarence Marie Mediavilla, Lucia Ibalanta Caisan, Flora, Rebecca Yaldama, Ramon Urofan, Sami Madden, all my patients, Annabelle Ejercito, Des Eluso, Romeo Ilumerag, Oliver, Arlene Olivares, Ceres Brennan, Vanessa Patterson, AJ Eliana, Isaac, Carol Grace Euphemia, Father Shodo, Karen Gibson, Patsy Aranda, Lucy Santander, Margaret Henry Cross, Janeline Sidabia Manalo, Mar Mart Father Martin Nyland, Tita Eve Porras, Mary Grace Idhan, Tito June, Tito Rowley, Tito Henry, Baby Xander, Tito Enrico, Joey Almeda, Mam Sote, Rochelle Kim Tan, Thang Wen, Father Matthias Thelen, Denise Lindsay Sherry, Rosemary Oviedo, Christian Kai, Beatrice Ichaleco, Josefina Iscanlar, Jan Jesus Amontesa, Mary Grace Escobanias, Antonio Escamilian, Anthony, Antonio Rojas. For those who called by God ahead of us, may they be granted eternal rest, especially Tito Elmer, Julius Alulosan, Joseph Poltababa, Teresa Igamen, Simitrius Nakasawa, Manang Elena Delgado, Zalde Escorpiso, Tita Ines, Elia Sofisencia, Father Freddy Paulo, Irene Tiva, Adora Española, Fred Asistido, Bibito Galendez, Carolina Iaiti Miller, Susimo Ilambre, Beatriz Estopado, Tony Encho, Elsa Escaran, Lloyd Erfe, MJ Iscanian, Angeles Staton, Angelo and Irene Loisaga, Stephen and Lourdes Lipianek, Menard Mina, Berting Imanig, Mario Vashon and Antonio Gonzaga, Alma and Andy Estrebo, Rafael Clavia, Connie Thelma Ben and Rafael Rapatan, Jandy Hoff, Maria Cervantes, Antonio Bolivar, Milagros Idhan, Boy Noblesa, and Rosario Erdao. For the intentions of the prayer warriors of St. Hannibal, St. Augustine, St. John Paul II, Christ the Good Shepherd, Soldiers of Mary, St. Anthony, ASD Family, St. Monica, members of the Real Women, Members of Our Lady's Marian Movement for Priests, Father Peter Prokoskiewicz, please give them excellent health so they will continue to pray fervently for others, for all the intentions, worries, sufferings that we keep in the silence of our hearts. Let's unburden our hearts and offer them all to Mama Mary. The Litany of Humility, that our response be, Deliver us, Jesus. O Jesus, meek and humble of heart, Hear us from the desire of being esteemed, deliver us, Jesus. From the desire of being loved, deliver us, Jesus. From the desire of being extolled, deliver us, Jesus. From the desire of being honored, deliver us, Jesus. From the desire of being praised, deliver us, Jesus. From the desire of being preferred to others, deliver us, Jesus. From the desire of being consulted, deliver us, Jesus. From the desire of being approved, deliver us, Jesus. From the fear of being humiliated, deliver us, Jesus. From the fear of being despised, deliver us, Jesus. From the fear of suffering rebukes, deliver us, Jesus. From the fear of being calumniated, deliver us, Jesus. 
from the fear of being forgotten, deliver us, Jesus. From the fear of being ridiculed, deliver us, Jesus. From the fear of being wronged, deliver us, Jesus. From the fear of being suspected, deliver us, Jesus. That others may be loved more than I, more than us. Jesus, grant us the grace to desire it. That others may be esteemed more than us. Jesus, grant us the grace to desire it. That in the opinion of the world, others may increase and we may decrease. Jesus, grant us the grace to desire it. That others may be chosen and we set aside. Jesus, grant us the grace to desire it. That others may be praised and we unnoticed. Jesus, grant us the grace to desire it. That others may be preferred to us in everything. Jesus, grant us the grace to desire it, that others may become holier than us, provided that we may become as holy as we should. Jesus, grant us the grace to desire it. At being unknown and poor, Lord, we want to rejoice. At being deprived of the natural perfections of body and mind, Lord, we want to rejoice. When people do not think of us, Lord, we want to rejoice. When they assign us the meanest task, Lord, we want to rejoice. When they do not even deign to make use of us, Lord, we want to rejoice. When they never ask our opinion, Lord, we want to rejoice. When they leave us at the lowest place, Lord, we want to rejoice. When they never compliment us, Lord, we want to rejoice. When they blame us in season and out of season, Lord, we want to rejoice. Blessed are those who suffer persecution for Jesus' sake, for there is a kingdom of heaven. Amen. Now let's pray for our priests. May God give us holy and courageous priests. And also, for guidance of the following seminarian, Arnel Tagulala, Jan Sabedra, Dennis Lacerna Marcos, Rafael Ursalina, Bob Imagi, Charles Villanueva, Juan Arnaiz, Clifford Espinosa, Jerome Arizuelo, Clyde Yucashon, and Robert Ducado. O Jesus, our great high priest, hear our humble prayers on behalf of thy priest. Give them a deep faith, a bright and firm hope, and a burning love which will ever increase in the course of their priestly life. In their loneliness, comfort them. In their sorrow, strengthen them. In their frustrations, point out to them that it is through suffering that the soul is purified, and show them that they are needed by the church, they are needed by souls, they are needed for the work of redemption. O loving Mother Mary, Mother of Priests, Take to your heart your sons who are close to you because of their priestly ordination and because of the power which they have received to carry on the work of Christ in a world which needs them so much. Be their comfort, be their joy, be their strength, and especially help them to live and to defend the ideals of consecrated celibacy. Amen. We believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From then he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body and life everlasting. Amen. For the intention of our Holy Father, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Glory to the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Now we will reflect the five joyful mysteries. The first joyful mystery is the Annunciation. We offer you, O Lord Jesus, this first decade in honor of your incarnation in Mary's womb. And we ask of you, through this mystery and through her intercession, a profound humility. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who need most of thy mercy. The second joyful mystery is the visitation. We offer you, O Lord Jesus, this second decade in honor of the visitation of your Holy Mother to her cousin Elizabeth and the sanctification of St. John the Baptist. And we ask of you through this mystery, and through the intercession of your Holy Mother, charity toward our neighbor. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who need most of thy mercy. The third is the Nativity. We offer you, O Lord Jesus, this third decade in honor of your Nativity in the stable of Bethlehem. And we ask of you through this mystery and through the intercession of your Holy Mother, detachment from the things of the world, contempt of riches, and love of poverty. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who need most of thy mercy. The fourth is the presentation in the temple. We offer you, O Lord Jesus, this fourth decade in honor of your presentation in the temple and the purification of Mary. And we ask of you through this mystery and through the intercession of your Holy Mother, purity of body and soul. Amen. 
Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. And blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. And blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who need most of thy mercy. The fourth, the fifth is the finding of our Lord Jesus in the temple. We offer you, O Lord Jesus, this fifth decade in honor of Mary's finding you in the temple. And we ask of you through this mystery that through her intercession, the gift of true wisdom. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Jesus, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who need most of thy mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious, advocate thine eyes of mercy towards us, and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech thee, that by meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise, through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Prayer to St. Michael. St. Michael, the archangel, defend us in the day of battle. Be our safeguard against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And though thou, a prince of the heavenly host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the other evil spirits who prowl about the world, seeking the ruins of souls. Amen. May the divine assistance remain always with us, and may the souls of the faithful departed through the mercy of God rest in peace. Amen. The Divine Mercy Novena, we are now on the fourth day. Today, bring to me those who do not believe in God and those who do not yet know me. Most compassionate Jesus, you are the light of the whole world. Receive into the abode of your most compassionate heart the souls of those who do not believe in God and of those who as yet do not know you. Let the rays of your grace enlighten them that they too together with us may extol your wonderful mercy and do not let them escape from the abode which is your compassionate heart. Eternal Father, turn your merciful gaze upon the souls of those who do not believe in you and of those who who as yet do not know you, but who are enclosed in the most compassionate heart of Jesus. Draw them in the light to the light of the gospel. These souls do not know what great happiness it is to love you. Grant that that they too may extol the generosity of your mercy for endless ages. Amen. You expired, Jesus, but the source of life gushed forth for souls, and the ocean of mercy opened up for the whole world, O fount of life, unfathomable divine mercy, envelop the whole world and empty yourself out upon us. O blood and water which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, we trust in you. O blood and water which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, we trust in you. O blood and water which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, we trust in you. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is thy fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into 
the dead he ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of god the father almighty from then he shall come to judge the living and the dead i believe in the holy spirit the holy catholic church the communion of saints the forgiveness of sins the resurrection of the body and life everlasting amen now let's remember every bead we offer it to one of our family members or friends who are experiencing suffering or illness and we will intertwine it to the passion of jesus christ so it will have a redemptive value eternal father we offer you the body blood soul and divinity of your dearly beloved son our lord jesus christ in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world eternal father we offer you the body blood soul and divinity of your dearly beloved son our lord jesus christ in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and the whole world for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. Eternal Father, we offer you the body, blood, soul, and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. Eternal Father, we offer you the body, blood, soul, and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. Eternal Father, we offer you the body, blood, soul, and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world, for the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. 
For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and the whole world. Eternal God, in whom mercy is endless and a treasury of compassion and exhaustible, look kindly upon us and increase your mercy in us, that in difficult moments we might not despair nor become despondent, but with great confidence submit ourselves to your holy will, which is love and mercy itself. Jesus, we trust in you. St. Faustina, pray for us and the whole world, especially for those who are about to die on this day and have no one to pray for them. Jesus, have mercy on their souls. Amen. Thank you, everyone, who's being here with us. Thank you, Mama Mary and all the angels and saints. Please bestow the same blessings to all the prayer warriors who are not able to join us because of Wi-Fi issues. For those who are starting their day, may all their words and their actions will be pleasing to God. And for those who are about to rest, Please give them a tranquil and undisturbed rest. We ask this to the mighty name of Jesus Christ, our Lord, who reigns with you forever and ever. Amen. So thank you, everyone. In the name of the Father, the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Hello, Akai. Thank you for joining from Gimbal and Inda Iglesi. Thank you for joining from Austria. So I'll see you guys tomorrow the same times okay so let me see i don't know what if i don't pray tomorrow because i forgot what time i'm supposed to go to work tomorrow then i'll put it on the fb account okay but okay if there is no um uh what to call this announcement in the fb that means that we're gonna be praying tomorrow the same time okay okay see you guys so if you actually share our video, share the one on YouTube, okay? Because we need viewers on YouTube.